of order in architecture. By order in architecture is meant a system of all the members, proportions and ornaments of columns and pilasters, or it is a regular arrangement of the projecting parts of a building, which, united with those of a column, form a beautiful, perfect and complete whole. Good evening, and welcome to tonight's presentation, From the Quarries, an archive of Masonic Law. Of its antiquity. From the first formation of society, order in architecture may be traced. When the rigour of seasons obliged men to contrive shelter from the inclemency of the weather, we learn that they first planted trees on end and then laid others across to support a covering. The bands which connected those trees at top and bottom are said to have given rise to the idea of the base and capital of pillars, and from this simple hint, originally preceded the more improved art of architecture. The Five Orders The Five Orders are thus classed. The Tuscan, Doric, Ionic, Corinthian, and Composite. The Tuscan is the most simple and solid of the Five Orders. It was invented in Tuscany, whence it derives its name. Its column is seven diameters high, and its capital, base, and entablature have but few mouldings. The simplicity of the construction of this column renders it eligible where ornament would be superfluous. The Doric, which is plain and natural, is the most ancient, and was invented by the Greeks. Its column is eight diameters high, and has seldom any ornament on base or capital except mouldings, though the frieze is distinguished by triglyphs and metopes, and triglyphs compose the ornament of the frieze. The solid composition of this order gives it a preference in structures where strength and a noble simplicity are chiefly required. The Doric is the best proportioned of all the orders, the several parts of which it is composed are founded on the natural position of solid bodies. In its first invention, it was more simple than in its present state. In after times, when it began to be adorned, it gained the name of Doric, for when it was constructed in its primitive and simple form, the name of Tuscan was conferred on it. Hence the Tuscan precedes the Doric in rank, on account of its resemblance to that pillar in its original state. The Ionic bears a kind of mean proportion between the more solid and delicate orders. Its column is nine diameters high, its capital is adorned with volutes, and its cornice has dentals. There is both delicacy and ingenuity displayed in this pillar, the invention of which is attributed to the Ionians as the famous Temple of Diana at Ephesus was of this order. It is said to have been formed after the model of an agreeable young woman of an elegant shape, dressed in her hair, as a contrast to the Doric order, which was formed rather after that of a strong, robust man. The Corinthian, the richest of the five orders, is deemed a masterpiece of art. Its column is ten diameters high, and its capital is adorned with two rows of leaves and eight volutes, which sustain the abacus. The frieze is ornamented with curious devices, the cornice with dentals and modillions. This order is used in stately and superb structures. Of the invention of this order. It was invented at Corinth by Callimachus, who is said to have taken the hint of the capital of this pillar from the following remarkable circumstance. Accidentally passing by the tomb of a young lady, 
he perceived a basket of toys, covered with a tile, placed over an acanthus root, having been left there by her nurse. As the branches grew up, they encompassed the basket, till, arriving at the tile, they met with an obstruction, and bent downwards. Callimachus, struck with the object, set about imitating the figure, the vase of the capital he made to represent the basket, the abacus, the tile, and the volutes, the bending leaves. The composite is compounded of the other orders, and was contrived by the Romans. Its capital has the two rows of leaves of the Corinthian, and the volutes of the Ionic. Its column has the quarter round as the Tuscan and Doric order, is ten diameters high, and its cornice has dentils or simple modillions. This pillar is generally found in buildings where strength, elegance, and beauty are displayed. Of the invention of order in architecture. The ancient and original orders of architecture revered by Masons are no more than three, the Doric, Ionic, and Corinthian, which were invented by the Greeks. To these, the Romans have added two, the Tuscan, which they made plainer than the Doric, and the Composite, which was more ornamental, if not more beautiful, than the Corinthian. The first three orders alone, however, show invention and particular character, and essentially differ from each other. The two others have nothing but what is borrowed, and differ only accidentally. The Tuscan is the Doric in its earliest state, and the Composite is the Corinthian enriched with the Ionic. To the Greeks, therefore, and not to the Romans, we are indebted for what is great, judicious, and distinct in architecture. For more Masonic podcasts, videos, music, texts, and artwork, visit fromthequarries.com or subscribe to our YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook accounts by searching From the Quarries. Thank <laughs> you.